Tuesday, I also want to get in the Tech Tuesday bit that I like to share with my real estate uh, clients and my investor friends who are out there building their real estate business. Um, and this way it can help you build your real estate business. Uh, but this actually can help, this tool can help you build um, multiple, it can be used for multiple kinds of businesses. So you might even find a use for this uh, in your current business right now, even if it's not real estate. So however you came and found us on the channel, maybe you found us through Facebook or YouTube, what I recommend you do regardless is get over to our YouTube channel and subscribe to be notified on our um upcoming training videos. You can also get over to our YouTube channel. I don't know why I have this in. I apologize. <laughs> and I'm going to show you a really cool software that I've been using for, oh gosh, a number of years. I'm um, not sure if you can see that too well. Let's try to zoom this out. And I think that will help, right? Does that help? Let's see. Okay. All right. So I want to introduce you to Acuity Scheduling. Let's see if you can see that there. It's called Acuity Scheduling right there. Nothing's in the frame today. So Acuity Scheduling is, uh, and you can check it out at acuityscheduling.com. This is basically a calendar software application, okay? It's a SaaS, software as a service. And one thing I, I love about this is their slogan right here, never ask what time for work, that what time works for you again. I love that line and it's so true because whenever I hear this line, it, it actually annoys me now. Whenever I hear someone ask us, what time worked for you? What day worked for you? It's like, oh, because you know what that means. It's like constant emails back and forth, back and forth, which is just really annoying at the end of the day. So what's good about this is that in having a calendar, like I know there's other software platforms out there that do this. I would be careful about the free, free ones because when it's free, um, there, there's not a lot of attention put on the product or service, right? You don't have developers fixing bugs and stuff like that. So I, I don't recommend free calendar softwares, uh, but Acuity is really good because it does connect to all your calendars. And I'll show you that here in just a minute, but they give you a free uh, trial. You can actually go through it and test it out. Uh, and it, it's, it's really easy. Now, Acuity just recently got acquired by Squarespace. So if you like Squarespace, um, and you and maybe you have a website with Squarespace. They're really they're a big company and they they're doing some really powerful things. Um, so you can you can see that they acquired them to actually build them into their software, which is really nice. Um, which might even drive down price here in the near future. So one of the good things, let me just zoom in here a little bit more so we can see up close what's happening. Um, you can control, let's move that there, okay. Uh, control your availability 24 seven. You can organize your schedule right within the app. It's in the desktop and app form. So they also have an app as well. You can organize your client's information because you're gonna get either their name, their phone number, whatever you want, whatever kind of information you wanna collect. Um, here is some subscribers. So now he, there's a lot of people like, I guess I'm gonna show you the industries. Let me show you the industries they work with. Um, do, 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 do. Let's see. Okay, I don't see it anymore because they recently changed, but let me show you some of their tools that they, they do and then maybe I can jump over to the industries that they've worked with. So number one, you can sync all your calendars, which is really nice. So if you have a Google Calendar or another calendar somewhere else, you can sync it all within Acuity. Next, you can accept online payments with Stripe, Square, or PayPal. So if you plan on, you know, depending on what kind of business you're running, uh, offer more than just appointments. You can give gift certificates, packages, memberships, or group classes, all within the, the software. Feel confident uh, knowing client information is private as part of HIPAA. So if you're running, you know, uh, you know, any business that requires those uh, guidelines, then that's great. Uh, reduce no-shows by sending customized reminder emails and texts to clients. This is really powerful. Reminders. I usually like to use the email reminder. I'm not a fan of using text reminders. I think that's a little too much and annoying. I think basically because I'm an email most of the day, so I like the email reminder. Meet clients anywhere, which is great. Now, uh, video con conferencing in integrations. One of the things uh, I know they definitely work with is Zoom. Um, they, they also work with a few other platforms, but Zoom is one of them. It's most popular right now. 
So they connect with there. You can connect um, your calendar via, you can share it and connect it via Facebook, Instagram, email, or through your website. You can actually have your calendar embedded into your website if you wanted to. And you can actually do your own custom brand if you wanted to. So here's some of the apps that they connect with. All right, so let's jump into the pricing. I always like to show you that and show you the pricing on the software. Okay, all right, so you can try it for seven days free, which I'd recommend so you can get a full experience of it, depending on how big your calendar is, uh, excuse me, your business is and what you need it for. Most of the time, the clients that I work with, they're typically between the emerging and growing stages. I actually haven't worked with anybody who needs you know, a powerhouse of 36 calendars and staff and all that stuff. Um, so typically the growing one or the emerging, now if you're just starting out, I wouldn't even recommend the solo, okay? Even if you just buy yourself. And the reason why is you need this one calendar integration. You need the one calendar, like Google Calendar. So you need to start at this point. Now they do have an annual plan. This is just like a, sh a secret. Um, you can actually pay annually and it will reduce this rate. I think I'm paying like $10 a month or like $8.88 a month, something like that. So you can actually pay annually and get a discount on that. But I would recommend you first start with the free trial so you can get the full experience and see what it's like, okay? Now let's jump down to additional features because this comes with all paid plans. All the paid, all the paid, <laughs> paid plans come with these features, okay? So uh, schedule, um, embed it into your website, sync with Outlook, Exchange, or Office 365, syncing with iCloud. So if you use iCloud, you can sync it to that. Google Calendar, sync to there. You can use GoToMeeting, Join.me, Zoom integrations for online meetings. You can also sync it to QuickBooks, FreshBooks, and Xero. And why this is important, because if you're taking payments, Right from, your, uh, right from your calendar, you can do it through there. You can also integrate it with an email marketing platform, which is really nice. A lot of other softwares don't do that, but there's integration API for that as well. You also get pipe drive integration for sales or CRM. So you can see how they're really building this all together now. This is actually a newer feature now that uh, Squarespace, excuse me, Squarespace has uh, acquired them. All right, so the next thing is uh, you can also integrate it with Zapier. And if you don't know what Zapier is, what I'd recommend, I'll actually put a video to the end of this video so you can check it out. So, Or you can just go to our YouTube, type in Fearless Millionaire. You can subscribe to our page and we have a video there on Zapier. But I will post it at the end of this video so you can see it. You'll see it towards the end of the video. You can watch it from there. You can also accept payments and deposits through PayPal, Square, and Stripe. Um, you can also vault credit cards, okay? So if someone wants to put down like a deposit, you can do that also. Uh, you can have clients tip you on here as well. You can offer coupons, vouchers, or discounts. You can offer classes and workshops and even group events. So we actually use this for some meetups, but also my cousin uses this for uh, workshops. So you can do that also. You can easily add upsell clients with checkout and add-on. So if someone's buying one product, you can actually easily add an upsell, which is a really nice feature. And there's also some great advanced reporting. One thing they don't really focus on here is uh, interesting enough, I think because right now they are just being acquired by Squarespace, they don't mention their, um, their app their uh, mobile app. And I know they haven't, maybe they're not gonna focus too much attention on it. Maybe they're like updating it and rebranding it and stuff and stuff like that. But as you can see here at the bottom of the page, it says build a beautiful website. When you click on that, it takes you to Squarespace. So they've recently got acquired by Squarespace and they're basically integrating both of them together, okay, into the, the services. So if you see, if you're on Squarespace, then you will be able to see how you can integrate calendar. You see right here, explore scheduling. So they kind of integrated and married the two with people's websites. So Squarespace is a, is a decent platform. It's very simple, very easy to use. Um, I don't recommend it for, you know, uh, the real estate industry, you know, real estate websites are pretty specific. And if you're looking for a specific real estate website, then what I'd recommend you do is in the links below, I do have some links there that you could get a real estate website and try it out. And I highly recommend those specifically for real estate rather than something like Squarespace. So Squarespace is very specific for certain industries uh, and real estate websites should be very specific to you know real, the real estate industry. So. That is my update. I highly recommend you use 
Acuity scheduling software, Acuity scheduling. I'll put a link in the comments in the description below. Um, and also, if you have any questions, you can leave it in the comments. But I will share a quick story with you. I was just uh, setting up a meeting with an entrepreneur um, out of New York. And, uh, you know, downtown New York, Manhattan, right? The address is, you know, Park Avenue. And I was setting up a meeting and in the email conversation, it went like this. It went something, I should have pulled it up, but it basically went, hey, what day this week works for you? What times are you available? And I was like, oh, really? And I basically asked, I said, do you have a calendar link? And he said, no. Now you would think that a company that's you know just recently raised a bunch of money and you know in New York you know that they would have a calendar link right I mean that's what I would think but well, that's what I would hope them to have obviously they, they didn't so what I ended up doing was sending my calendar link over to them and I said hey boss if you could just you know use my calendar link book a day and time that works best for you right and he did so you know and i also sent him the link to acuity so he could get his own calendar <laughs> because i think in this day and age especially whether no matter what business you're in if you value your time if you value the time in your life then you will have a calendar link and you're not just going back and forth because it makes it so much easier you can even put this calendar link on your website in your embed it in your signature in your email you can put it anywhere you want on your Facebook business page. You can integrate it with your Facebook business page if you wanted to. You can put it into your Instagram profile, whatever you want. You can integrate these things. And that's really important as a business owner because I'll tell you one thing that I learned a long time ago about time and productivity when I was going through some productivity trainings is that this is the lesson. If you don't respect your time, don't expect anyone else to respect your time. Does that make sense? That means if you don't respect your own time, don't expect anyone else to care and respect you for your time. And that's a that's a true statement because if you're just you know not monitoring or not caring about your time, and, and everything's an open door to you, well, guess what? You will breed those results. You'll breed the, and track those kinds of people who just suck and zap your time. So. With that being said, I would highly recommend checking out the videos that are about to pop up here on the screen. You can get over and check those out. Also check over our, our uh, you know, our YouTube channel and I will see you next time, probably tomorrow, <laughs> right here on the Fearless Millionaire channel. Take care.